Hello and welcome to another episode of Carl's Coppers and today I built this huge Dakota. The whole thing is made out of bits of balsa wood and it's made out of duct tape and bits of string as you can see here. The only thing that's original are the landing gear. I've still got an engine to put on it. I'm going to test it. What we're going to do, the plan is uh, build this plane as it is now. It looks rough. It will be because it's made out of duct tape and bits of junk and uh, we're going to see what we can do, we can either put rockets on it or something and we'll see if we can make this thing fly or some kind of electric motors but the weight it just goes up and up and up with it being duct tape because you know yourself if you pick a piece of duct tape up it's quite heavy so we're going to have to think of some way of getting it airborne but I do like the look of it because it does give it that really old World War II look that's been old and haggard uh, let's have a quick look at it as you can see um, I've done duct tape and then I painted it as well sprayed some uh, silver spray on top and um, that just helps the duct tape stay in place it acts like a glue as well and um, they've got engine mounts there look. but it does look a bit worse for wear <laughs> look around this side I mean already it's starting to come apart there <laughs> and there's a bit of duct tape flapping under the fuselage so it will probably need another coat of silver uh, spray or glue spray glue might do it uh, it does have flaps as well and the back is botched up good style and the front's not too clever either um, this car that you can see down here man you does look all right though uh, this car that you see down there, that's 124 scale, so you can tell how big this plane is, it's huge. And uh, I've got a nice little test area, which uh, should be fun. I'm thinking we might even slingshot the thing and see how it goes. But I'll put some engines on it first, or some kind of engines. I mean, look at how crude it is, let's get close up. Look how crude that is. <laughs> but it only took about a day to knock up out of junk so it's not going to be the best thing since sliced bread and I put some old aircraft wheels on as well from other projects and like I said the whole thing is connected up with a string I mean that's an old just look at it really and I've even found some old decals and they didn't work because they were probably like 20 year old so this is Carl's Copters and thanks for watching and don't forget folks you can subscribe and watch this thing fly as soon as I sort out the engines but before I send it up in the air I will put the engines on and do another video first and then I'll tell you that we're when to keep an eye out for the next video of it flying in the air or crashing in the air or falling from the sky um, but it, it does look quite cool in a way uh, this is Carlos Gopters. Thanks for watching.